Audrey here. I'm Margo. Shannon here. Brittany here, and welcome to this week's episode of My Code. This week, we'll be talking to you about what's it like to be a girl who codes. Let's get started. To be a girl who codes is so rewarding. To be a girl who codes, we sometimes have to break the gender roles. Sometimes we might be the only girl in our computer science class. Your gender does not affect how good you are at computer science. The main difference is in how other people treat you. Some people might think that it means you're worse at coding or that you deserve some kind of special treatment. It's important to remember that your gender and your coding skills are not related. Being a girl who codes definitely pushes me to work harder because I know a lot of people aren't used to seeing women in tech and might be doubtful that I even know what I'm doing, but that just gives me the extra motivation to prove them wrong. That feeling when you finally debug your code or when you finish a project makes you feel unstoppable. I've heard comments before like, oh, you're a girl and you like coding? You must be really into web design. Or, since you're the only girl in our group, you can work on the front end part of our project and make it really pretty. I think one of the biggest myths I've encountered as a girl who codes is that we aren't as good as coding as boys, which is entirely untrue. Anybody can be great at coding. One of the biggest myths I've heard about coders is that if you're not a white male wearing a zip-up hoodie, then you're not gonna fit into the coding scene. Some people might say that a girl who codes can only code that she can't be a girly girl, or an athletic, or a nature lover. We like to hang out with friends, listen to music, and play sports. A girly girl can be a coder, or an athletic star can be a coder as well. Being a girl does not limit what parts of computer science you're allowed to like and be good at. My absolute girl code is to support one another. Don't tear each other down or view each other as competition. I think it's really important to finish any tasks you start and also keep any commitments you make. My girl code is to dream every day, learn as much as you can, strive for the best. My girl code is sometimes you just gotta try it. That doesn't mean you should work yourself to the bone, however. If you need a mental, physical, emotional break, take one. As a first generation child, I'll be the first in my family to go to college. And I'll also be the first in my family to pursue a career in the STEM field as a computer programmer. If people are doubting your abilities, the best way to prove them wrong is to stay focused and get your work done because the only thing better than saying what you're gonna do is actually doing it. People will underestimate you, but if you view their criticisms as a challenge, and if you stay persistent, nothing will stop you. Thanks for tuning in to our hashtag girl code episode. We wanna know what your girl code is. Make sure to write them down in the comment section below. See you next week to talk about what code actually is. Thanks, bye. Thanks, bye guys.